Well, I'm absolutely delighted now to be joined by uh, Dr. Barbara Jones, who's the chair of the March Meeting Programme uh, Committee. Dr. Jones, welcome. Thank you. Thank, thank you. Thank you for taking the time to talk to us today. Oh, yes. Well, I think Web's Edge is a very good thing. So, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Now, you were chair of the uh, Programme Committee. You are chair of the Programme Committee. What, what were you trying to achieve through the Programme Committee this year? Well, the uh, APS at the March meeting is represented by many units. And some of these units have a large number of, of, of members. Uh, Division of Condensed Matter Physics is one of them. Division of Materials Physics, the Forum of Industrial Applied Physics. These are all have large um, a number of people. But there are other units that have a smaller number. And the key thing that I find for the March meeting is to make sure that even those units that have a smaller, may have a smaller number of, of um, members, still do not get shunted to uh, the edges of the meeting and um, are, are as much a part of the March meeting um, as the larger units. And that's one thing that has always been characterized of, of the March meeting, it's diversity and the large number of subjects that we have all meeting at once. There's so much overlap at all times between all of these subjects that it's always best to have them under one roof. And, and so that is our goal, to have a March meeting that is as representative as possible and filled with exciting topics as possible. So what are some of this year's most exciting topics, do you think? Well, I mean, there, there are many, of course. I would say um, one thing to, to give a shout out to is the new uh, topical group on the physics of climate. And um, they have an invited uh, symposium this year. Um, there we have a, a Kavli session, which we call a plenary, which is going to be happening on Wednesday afternoon. We have another session, which is, um, uh, we call an outreach session, which is Monday night. And um, that session is going to be with um, representatives of the Department of Energy and also um, uh, George Crabtree, who's going to be talking about mesophysics and a new study of the Department of Energy, which just came out. And we hope this is going to be at a level that everybody at the March meeting would be able to attend. And another thing I wanted to point out is Thursday evening, there's going to be um, not one, but both of the Nobelists from last year are going to be here. And in the evening, there's going to be a session in which these Nobelists are going to be talking about their Nobel Prize research. And then there's going to be a reception following that. Right. And, and there's a lot there, isn't there? Now, yeah. The other thing, you talk about diversity. There's a lot of people here from all over the world. And there's a lot of people here of all sorts of different ages as well. How important is it for you that it's a, an all-embracing meeting like that? It's very important to us. This is one of the few meetings in which graduate students um, get such a pre an opportunity to present um, because everybody who's a member of the APS can give a 10 minute talk. These sessions at the March meeting um, have a, a lot of graduate students who are for the very first time perhaps giving a talk in public and it's very important that they get this practice and be able to represent their, their research and their group. Um, and then of course we have a, a huge range we even have undergraduate presenters and then we have a range all the way up through um, all the different stages postdoc assistant professor more senior all, all the way up and it's very important to us at this meeting in particular that all the various um, ages especially young people um, get a chance to present the other question I had you're from IBM how important is it that uh, companies such as IBM and academia are, are well linked Oh, it's very important that they be linked. Um, industry tends to be problem rich. And so we have um, um, many problems that we think would be of interest to academia. And likewise, academia is very important because they have um, manpower and interested, excited, enthusiastic students. And postdocs and, and a very important source of, of very fundamental research often that's very important for the industry to find out. And so the March meeting is a very good way for both sides to find out what's happening. So we were trying to get, given the current structure of the March meeting, um, to get as many industrial people to come say, look, see what we are like, see the interesting physics, the exciting physics that we have for you to hear about and vice versa for the students and, and everybody else as well. Well, thank you very much indeed for joining us today. Really appreciate it. It's a fascinating meeting and I hope you have a great week. Thank you. Thank you very much.